So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel informational educational video. So here in this video, I will talk about a very important information for all the students of J2022. No matter whether you are from general category OBC, SC, ST, PWD candidate or EWS candidate or male or female, this video will provide you very important information for all of you. So please try to watch the video till the end. So basically here I will talk about the number of seat available in NIT, IIIT, JFTIN, IITs as well. It is category wise I will talk about number of seat available it is how much seat are reserved for sc candidate st candidate pwd candidate obc ews and how much seat are left for general candidate so all those things in this video i will talk about and all total how many seats are there including iits and it triple it gfti i will provide you and and separately also i will provide you so please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get the complete information about j mains and j advance in the upcoming days as well and also you will get all the update at the right time about J means J advance and other counseling other interest exam also in this same channel so let's start this video so here is the total number of seat available in NIT, IIIT, GFTI and IIT's college. So here I will provide you the category wise all the information that is for general EWS, OBC, SC, ST and also I will con consider all category PWD. Suppose if you are from general PWD, EWS, PWD, OBC, SC, ST, PWD then also you will get the information in the same video. So before going forward for this video I would like to inform you that I have already provided so many information about J means and the advanced that is marks versus your rank, marks versus your percentile percentile versus your category rank so all those information you will able to get in the same channel and in the upcoming days also i will try to provide you lots of information about j mains and the advanced and other counseling other entrance exam also in the same channel similar to the last year so it's my request to you please try to subscribe and share this video to your friends so that they can also get this information so let's continue this video so let's talk about iit's first that is total number of seat available in iit college so here is the information that is category wise i will talk about for general there are six 1260 seat available that is I am talking about present what are the number of seat available that I am talking in this video and each year there is an increment of about 5% in each type of college so you can expect there will be increment in the seat number of IITs, NITs, IIIT, GFTA as well this year also. So for general category there are 6260 seat available in IIT college and for general PWD 336 seat are available and for EWS 1526 seat are available as you all for EWS candidate there are 10% uh, 10 reservation in IIT's college and for EWS PWD there are 75% reservation as I said in my previous video that is there will be 5% horizontal reservation for PWD candidate suppose if you are from EWS PWD then there will be 5% of the EWS seat will be reserved for you that is 75 seat is reserved for EWS PWD candidate and for SC 2304 seat are available and for SC PWD 125 seat are available and for ST 1161 seat are available and for ST PWD 61 seat and for OBC 4125 seat are available and for OBC PWD 219 seat and now if you talk about the total seat in IITs including all the reservation that is female male and all type of reservation that is uh, category wise there are total 16,232 seats including all the branches of all 23 IITs of India. So one more thing I would like to uh, tell you here that is no home state reservation is available in IIT college as you see in the NIT's home state and other state cutoff but in IITs there is no home state reservation like things and uh, there will be 20% seat for female as you all know Supreme Court said that there will be at least 20% seat enrollment with the female candidate so the in some NI, some IIT there is 30% seat 25% seat so equal to or above than 20% will be reserved for female candidate so next if you talk about total seats in NIT that is the most important information for the student as of now so uh, here is the information that is for general 9147 seat and for general PWD 467 seat and EWS 2359 seat and these are the seat by including all the branches that is CS, IT, EC, electrical, mechanical, civil, all the branches that is dual degree course as well. So next we could talk about for EWS, PWD then there is 137 seat available for SC, so 3341 seat, for SC, PWD 189 seat, for, for ST 2043 seat, for ST, PWD 104 seat and for OBC 5894 seat are available and for OBC PWD 316 seat and now if you talk about the total number 
of seat available in NITs as of now that is there are total 32 NIT available in the India that is the latest NIT is IIEST Sipur. So uh, after including all the branches of all those 32 NIT there are total 23,997 seat available by including all type of reservation that is home state, other state and all the category male, female total around 24,000 seats are available but it is, it is most among all these four type of college that is IIT, NIT, IIIT, GFTI college. So, so here is the information that is home and other state are included as I told, uh, as I told you earlier and uh, there will be 25 to 30 percent seat for female reservation as you all know there is separate cutoff for male and female all in IT so there is female reservation it is around 25 to 30 percent seat so next let's talk about total seat in triple IT college so here is the information for general 2442 seat are available for general PWD 116 for EWS 548 for, for EWS PWD 26 seat are available and for SC 876 that is 876 seat are available and for SC PWD 43 seats are available and for 438 and for STPWD 16 seat are available and for OBC 1561 seat are available and for OBC PWD 80 seat are available and now if you talk about the total number of seat in all the all the triple ITs of India is 6146 and these are the number of seat that you will get through JOSA there are some I, uh, triple IT that is not that is not available through JOSA counseling you have to do separate counseling such as Jack uh, such as Jack Delhi for triple IT Delhi and the separate counseling for triple IT Hyderabad Triple Bangalore as well. So now only CS, IT, and EC brands are available in the uh, in all the Triple ITs college. That's so why the number of seats are less as compared to the IITs and NITs. So one more information that is 15 to 25 percent seat are, are reserved for female content here as well. It is in Triple IT also. So next, if you talk about total seat in GFTI college, that, that is, is government, government funded technical institutions. So here is the information for general 2906. For general PWD 155, for EWS 564, and for EWS PWD 23, for SC 809, for ST, uh, SC PWD 44, for ST 485, for ST PWD 20 seat are available, for OBC 1028, and OBC PWD 44 seat are available, and for and now if you talk about total number of seat, it is 6078 seat that is available by combining all the branches of all the GFTI of India. Is one more information that is a very less reservation is available for girls if you compare it with the NIT, triple IT and IIT scholars here the reservation is a little bit less and uh, to, uh, so now the important thing that you should analyze is total number of a student in J every year is around 9 plus lakh a student but there are total only 52,453 seats are available so now you can imagine how much is the competition and there are also lots of a student are from reserve category so those students get the college easily but the major major a student it is from general EWS OBC those students find it very difficult for the admission and the reason behind this is the less number of seat so, so this, this is all about the total number of seat available in iits and it's triple it gfti college as of now so hope you find this video very useful so please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all the update of j mains and j advance in the same channel and very soon i will provide you a video about the safe score that is safe percentile for nits that is top 5 top 10 top 15 top 20 or lower lowest possible nits how much percentile you should have category wise i will talk in that video so please try to subscribe to my humble request to you so that you will be getting that video very soon in this same channel.